Hello everybody, today is Wednesday, February 10th, 2021, 36 Fahrenheit, 2 degrees Celsius. I'm in front of the New York City Hall, and today I'll be walking over the Brooklyn Bridge into Brooklyn. First thing I notice is that the area around City Hall is pretty quiet. Normally around this time, four o'clock, there'll be a lot more people walking around the streets. The city uh, did shovel the bike lane here. Very important bike lane for people to go across the Brooklyn Bridge. Speaking of bicycles as well, there is a plan to convert the Manhattan bound innermost lane for bicycles. The innermost lane going to Manhattan is right now for cars only, but that will be converted into a two-way protected bike lane. If any of you have watched my previous videos of the Brooklyn Bridge, you know how the shared bicycle and pedestrian path can be quite crowded at times and cluttered. So this should hopefully alleviate a lot of those problems. Looking at City Hall Park right now, as well as the Brooklyn Bridge City Hall subway station. And here's the Manhattan Municipal Building with the Civic Fame statue on top, although you can't see it from this angle. So let's walk across the Brooklyn Bridge. Haven't walked across this bridge in months, so we'll get to see what's new with it. I don't know the time frame of when the city's going to install the protected bike lane, but until that happens, we're still going to have close encounters between pedestrians and cyclists. Look at that, even the sign didn't make it. The sign used to be here, I think. But this is where we get viral videos like the Brooklyn Bridge Star Wars singer. Seems like this bridge is shoveled pretty well from what I can tell right here at the entrance. I have ridden across this bridge when it was snowing and the city's usually pretty good about taking care of the snow when it happens. The thing you have to worry about this bridge is that up ahead there's wooden boards and that part gets very icy. Any kind of moisture on those wooden boards you lose traction and it's not good for pedestrians or cyclists. I've almost slipped a few times with either method. Here's a view of the Manhattan Municipal Building from the rear.
Even looks like the Brooklyn Bridge is undergoing some construction now on the Manhattan uh, Tower. Then again, it is an old bridge. It's built way in the 1800s. And it's amazing that it's still standing. There's the oldest major crossing and the other one is the Washington Bridge which is the second oldest. If anyone's watched my video of that, that bridge definitely needs some work. Looks like the Washington Bridge was falling apart when I walked across it. That one connects uh, the Morris Heights neighborhood of the Bronx to Washington Heights. This bridge here connects City Hall in Manhattan with Dumbo and downtown Brooklyn. So the innermost lane here is going to be converted into a two-way protected bike lane. I hope by protection that doesn't mean that the city just puts in plastic bollards and dividers in there because that's not protection at all, just a flimsy piece of plastic. They need to put some kind of barrier there to protect the cyclists from the cars. I don't know what that's going to do to traffic, but hopefully there'll be less incidents like that. Looking down at the financial district now, can't really see the South Street Seaport area from this angle. And this side over here is the two bridges neighborhood. Once I get to the Manhattan Tower, we'll have a great view of the New York City skyline. I wonder if they close that side of the Manhattan Tower. That might cause some conflicts between the cyclists and the pedestrians if that happens. Great view of the Manhattan skyline there. Now I can see the South Street Seaport area from this angle. This is 
always a popular photography spot. Over there I see Pier 17, that glass building over there. Did someone drop a piece of paper here? Looks like someone's map. Manhattan Bridge. What in the world is that thing? Looks like a army plane or something. Something I've never seen before. What the heck? That does not seem like a regular plane. Definitely military. Also, I got the right angle to capture it on video. At first, I thought it was a drone, but then it got closer. I was like, wait, there's no way that's a drone. Yeah, look at this. All this construction here on the right side. I guess they're doing renovations to the tower here. Oh my gosh, I gotta be careful of that. I just saw some snow or some ice fall off on the top of the tower there. Something I gotta be careful of. Looks like they have a construction crew here now. They're doing something over here. But yeah, I'm looking up to make sure I don't get hit by any icicles. Looks like there's some moisture here. Oh gosh, that was slippery. That didn't look like ice, but I almost slipped on it. Yeah, there's water dripping from the top there. So if you're coming to the Brooklyn Bridge now, be careful of this area because it's very slippery. Well, this area over here being fenced off a little bit isn't really too good for the tourists and the people who want to take pictures here. more ice over here. Let's walk around it this time. There's the Manhattan Bridge over there. We've got a subway crossing over as well. There's a few ferry boats in the East River coming this way. Also, 
Am I able to see the Statue of Liberty? Not yet. Not yet. Should be able to see it like halfway between the Manhattan and the Brooklyn Tower. Unless the visibility is so bad I can't see it. All right, there it is. Liberty enlightening the world. Whoa, that was close. Oh my gosh. Gotta be careful of falling snow and ice on this bridge. Well, this is an issue. I just saw another piece of snow fall off from the other side of the bridge into the river on this side. I missed it on camera, but it happened. Another piece of snow that fell over here, but from this distance, it won't hurt anybody. It's when you get over there, that's the issue. I should be wearing a hard hat crossing over this bridge or borrow someone's bicycle helmet coming by. We got the shot of Midtown over there. People like to take pictures from this side. seeing some more snow melting off on the other tower. Right now, it's pretty common for all the snow to melt off. Now it's just a little bit above freezing, so stuff can't come off the bridge. I don't see much ice though. Ice is more damaging than the snow, but still you wouldn't want to get hit by snow either.
was another chunk of something that came off the bridge. This is the scary part now, because now the cables are very high and you don't know what could come down at any moment's notice. I think what I will do is put on my hood so at least I'll have some kind of protection in case some ice starts falling down. It's not much, but... Wow. I think you just saw that some snow came off. Looks like they're doing some more work over here. Looks like there's an art group over here, sketchbook. There's Brooklyn Bridge Park down below, as well as Dumbo. That's the acronym for the neighborhood down under the Manhattan Bridge overpass. There was just a bunch of ice that fell on the roadway over here where the cars are. I just saw that big thing of snow fall down. Even if it falls down onto the roadway, it could be bad for drivers too. I think what's going on with the Brooklyn Bridge right now with all the snow and stuff coming off it is more dangerous than when the Brooklyn Bridge is packed because at least as a cyclist when I was crossing it you could control your speed with this you just kind of have to like hope you don't get hit you know what these are new the city installed these uh Lamp posts here. I've never seen these before. Unless I didn't recognize them from before, but I probably crossed this bridge more times than most, so I kind of have a feeling those weren't there before. Well, I'm glad I crossed the bridge of death without getting hit by any snow or ice. That seems like something you shouldn't be driving here. But I'd much rather be driving that than 
a bicycle which will maybe get hit by that snow and ice and lose control. At least that vehicle seems a little bit more stable. Looks like there's a new building going up here. Traffic on the BQE cantilever section as usual. That section of the BQE is up for renovations. Yeah, you can see there's a lot of traffic on the exit ramp to get into the BQE. exit over here at the Dumbo exit. If you keep walking straight, you'll exit at downtown Brooklyn. Now there's a lot of water here. Definitely a lot of hazards crossing the bridge today. Snow and ice falling from the bridge. There was a military aircraft flying over. And now we have puddles of water at the entrance here. Anyway folks, I made it to Brooklyn. If you enjoyed this walk of the Brooklyn Bridge from City Hall into Dumbo, be sure to smash the like button for me. Subscribe for some more video, uh, videos like these. And I will see you next time. Take care, folks. Bye-bye.